Well, uh, I mean, we're a mentally tough team, so we never want to give up. Um, when we down, and we always on fight and claw um, until the game is over. So uh, we take pride in that. So uh, we're going to continue to do that. Uh, we just got to you know, be a little bit more physical. You got to be a little physical tougher. Um, just match the physicality. Obviously, there's some guys who haven't been in these scenarios. You've played a lot of basketball. How do you relay that message to them that, you know, it's, it's about shortening those pockets where you allow teams to get those runs and the momentum? Oh, uh, you know, this one, uh, just throwing meetings. Uh, we watch a film, just commenting, uh, commenting on past experiences and um, things we got to do, uh, things we got to do better. Um, just trying to relay that. Uh, you know, it's been a, got a lot of guys that haven't been in the situation before, and we got a team for for experienced guys. So just gotta, you know. Grow on the grow on the job really. Um, while we in it, just gotta learn and grow uh, quick. It's, um, so we, we we definitely gotta get this game tomorrow. You've been struggling with some physical issues in your back, and you found a way last night to be a, a contributor on both ends of the floor. How good did that feel? And in the heat of the battle, knowing that you still had stuff that you could provide for your team. Yeah. Um, it's tough uh, when he's physically not there, but uh, I mean, I'm going to give him the team all I have. Um, I'm going to keep fighting, you know, keep working hard, trying to, you know, get myself ready, uh, ready to play, and try to help this team. And I mean, at this point, there's no, there's no looking back, so he's got to leave it all on the court. Obviously, game four. The Nets have an opportunity to go up 3-1 on you guys, and that's a deficit that's very difficult to come out of. How does this team, do they prepare any differently for a situation like that, or is it just a game plan of going out there and getting the job done like you would every other night? Oh, uh, I mean, we definitely got to have a sense of urgency. Uh, but for us, uh, the two games we lost, we feel like it was, it was on us. Uh, we feel like we can control some of the things that took place that we didn't do well. Um, one thing is turnovers. Um, both games we lost, we had 19 turnovers. So I feel like we can cut those down and do some uh, a couple other things better that we haven't done in those two losses that give us a chance to win. Dwayne Casey's been imploring, you know, guys to fulfill their roles and, you know, try and be a part of the process. And right now he's, he's using different lineups, different matchups to try and get some things done. Is that a more difficult thing for a coach to try and figure out those lineups when things aren't going? Or does he need to have that available to be able to kind of spread it out and show them different looks? Uh, well, you know, he coaches just bottom line is supposed to try and win games. So um, he's just looking to do what he can do to try to, you know, win as many of these games as possible. So as players, we just have to be ready. Um, and then whatever our number is called, we just got to, you know, produce. Um, that's just what it, that's part of it. That's what we have to do. That's what we get paid to do.